I'm the artist Michael Zotos, and we're in January of 2023. What I want to discuss uh, today is the fact that my artwork actually is, is several forms of art at the same time. Okay, the first one is always what I call the spontaneous gesture, where I take a marker or whatnot, and I just suddenly make the form freehand. And then I look at it and I examine it, and that's one form of art. Okay, now those that I like, I will transfer to a piece of plywood. And I'll cut it out completely, and then I'll sand all around the edges and work the sanding process till I get it to have a, a, some nice shape to it. And then I'll prime it and paint it white. Okay? Now that's a second form of artwork. The shape itself is a piece of artwork. Okay? And then the third step, or the third work, is where I then embellish it. I put eyes and mouths on the pieces and I'll add features. Okay, that's a third stage and a third step, but it's also a third form of artwork. Okay, now here's what I'm getting at. You can go on YouTube and see art pieces, uh, videos I've put up, of pieces of my work every year, going back quite a while now. And what a lot of people don't know just looking at the pieces is that yes they're seeing something and it's interesting and it, it, it's kind of dynamic and, it, and, and people like it a lot that's why I'm able to put it out all over Eastern Long Island I've been in 40 locations and it's made 10 different newspaper articles maybe more every now and then another one crops up that I didn't even know about as far as newspaper articles and uh, there's a reason the reason is people like what I'm doing and what they may not realize, looking at the piece, you, you see, you notice the eyes and the mouths and the embellishment, you know, the features and all, but you may not realize that there's something to the shape that goes on first. Now, let me show you something. This is a shape that I created, and I like it, it's nice. And this is another shape, very similar, okay? And I like it that much better. Now, this particular shape, I'm gonna show it to you embellished, paint it up, okay? And here it is. Now, when you look at this, you see the features, the eyes, the mouth, the face, the whole thing but you may not really recognize right off that this is behind the curtain. And the combination is what I believe is really making the art to take. Okay, now I wanna show you another piece, all right, with a similar concept. This is a shape that I made, it's small, okay, and it's kind of, and I sanded it and shaped it until it looked nice. Now this one I didn't shape so nice, but you have it with the features on it. And what you don't realize looking at this is that something of this is behind the curtain. And here's another one, another example. Okay, this is an example of what I'm talking about. Here's a piece that's cut, sanded, primed, and painted white. And here's the same piece, reverse of it, but with the features. And when a, I think when a person sees this, they see what they're seeing, but they don't realize that this is behind the, the, the piece. And it's something you do know, but not necessarily consciously. Okay. 